I saw two cars that just got towed in and I wanted to show them both to you. So give me a second. The first one, an IS 300. I know a lot of people love these cars. Typical IS 300. It's loaded with stuff. There's a pair of vans, notorious BIG CD, mismatched license plates, the usual. But this thing, I think maybe a tree fell on it or something. I don't know, actually. It looks like a tree came through. I don't actually understand what happened. The dent is going outwards. So this IS300 came in. The guy must have taken the wheels off of it. That might go in the yard. That might go in the crusher. Probably going to go in the crusher. But the car I was excited about, because I like this old dumb stuff, this Oldsmobile Cutlass Sierra. What year is this thing? And how long has it been sitting somewhere? See if we can get inside and figure out what year it is. Oh, it's got the Rusty Jones sticker. This is a 1985, and I think it's been sitting somewhere since 1985. Do we have time to go through this? It's so gross. You'd have no idea how bad these things smell. Oh gosh, here's the Kenosha newspaper from September of 98. It really stinks so bad that I can't even go through this car with you guys. What is this? The correspondent magazine for Lutherans. Roll up windows, Broham. Of course it's got the Miller thing because it came out of Wisconsin. This car is full to the brim with junk. But yeah, I like seeing these old cars. This one's definitely going straight in the crusher. But I wish I knew the story on it. Doors locked. Doors locked. Now I'm curious. I do want to see one more. Let's grab this newspaper back here. See what this one is. Let's see what was happening. Sunday, February 15th, 1998. Oscar nominations. Looks like Titanic. Charter schools. Sports. Bucks are on a losing streak with Terrell Brandon. Coach Chris Ford. President's Day sale at the Boston store. 